Hi everybody, welcome back to Unknown Destination. Today we're asking the question, why are they not contacting me? Why have they not reached out yet? So group one, group two, group three, please pick a group and then I'll answer the question. Let's go with group one first. Okay, so why are they not contacting you? So, I feel like this person is kind of going, they've gone through a lot right now and they're going through a lot um, in regards of going through a lot of adversity and arguments and conflict and they're carrying a lot of burdens on themselves I see. Um, so yeah, they might be working towards something, they, they might be pursuing their passion, pursuing a creative endeavour and they're facing a lot of controversy at the moment a lot of adversity at the moment and something's just blocking their path and that they're, they're gonna they're having to defend themselves and fight people off and just try and stand up for what they believe in um they're trying to um reach their goals their aims everything that they want to achieve in life they're trying to reach that but it's proving to be a really big task on them and it's really weighing them down they're holding a lot of responsibilities at the moment they've got a lot of burdens that they're carrying towards reaching this goal and um, they're going through a lot. Um, the, all this negative energy that's surrounding them from going through a lot is causing them to have arguments with people close to them, their friends, their family, or just anyone really. And um, they're kind of having arguments with people and they're feeling like um, they're saying things that are hurting them. And even though they're winning the argument, they know that they haven't actually won and they want to apologize to um, people that they're arguing with out of you know just this attitude they don't want to argue with these people they're just dealing with so much right now that is causing them to have conflicts with people with, that they usually won't have conflicts with and they're having to um, um apologize to people and just feel bad for arguing with everyone because of this kind of horrible uh all, the, all these horrible things they're going through in this horrible mindset they have right now um i think they're trying really hard to look at things from a different perspective and um, they're trying to just take some time to themselves um, to look within themselves, look at what they want, look at how they can um, expand from this, how they can come out of this um, in a better light, how they can learn from all this experience, how they can keep their motivation, their determination up to reaching their goals, how they can keep that kind of mindset within them. They're just trying to find that inner strength and they're trying to spiritually expand themselves and become a better person from all this experience. They're trying to look at this whole horrible, this negative situation from a better perspective. And um, they're just, uh, they're staying still and just trying to observe things. Um, I see that they want to reach out to you and they want to have a, a successful relationship with you and they do seek that successful relationship. But, um, they're just going through some things right now and they're, tr they're having a tough time and they're just taking some time to themselves to try and recover from everything that's happening and, you know, um, be a better person. They do want to spend time with you, they do want to see you, they want to, um, you know, talk to you about whatever they're going through, but they're just trying to handle their emotions, um, see what the best, the best plan is for them and what's going to bring them the most happiness and fulfillment and they're trying to take some time to themselves to just um, become aware of all that and develop a better perspective on everything they're going through but they do want to reach out and I think they are thinking of you and they want to um, talk about whatever they're going through with you but they're just trying to take some time out right now to get themselves together that was the reading for group one thank you for watching please leave a comment if it resonated So yeah, um, group two, why won't they reach out to you? Ooh.
okay this person that you're thinking about has gone through somebody said something to them or um they've gone through a previous relationship in the past or currently that's really hurt them deep inside and really affected them and um they're feeling really sorry for themselves from this relationship and they've they've been hurt in the past they've been betrayed they've gone through something pretty horrible that they've had to learn a tough lesson about um they've gone through um some kind of conflict um so when they're thinking about reaching out to you they're trying to understand they understand that there is a lot of good things around your relationship they've experienced a lot of good things they've experienced a lot of vitality a lot of contentment a lot of fulfillment they've, they've felt like that they have achieved a lot and felt a lot with you and that you have a really good relationship going but um from this past experiences that they've, they've had that have that's hurt them they have a lot of anxieties around this relationship and they don't understand whether it's going to bring them that emotional fulfillment if um in the future something might happen and it'll end up hurting them again they want to protect themselves from the previous heartache that they've gone through so they have a lot of anxieties around the relationship with you and um they don't see that they just need to let go of these anxieties a little bit and they'll be able to um feel the fulfillment and the abundance that they know that they will feel with you um so yeah past relationships past occurrences are holding them back from reaching out i think and they have a lot of anxieties um they're not voicing their opinions about this to you and they're not being honest about all this with you well they're being honest but they're not talking about everything with you they're not revealing everything that they need to reveal with you for you to fully understand um what's happening um they're just trying to figure out whether something will bring them a lot of happiness or it will um or if there's something missing from it and they might get hurt again so i think that's what they're trying to figure out with your with the relationship they have with you um i think they have um they're aware of this hurt that they felt in the past and how it's um, influencing um how they feel about this relationship they have currently with you and how it's preventing them and holding them back so i feel like they will eventually um surpass this kind of feeling and they will un um fully accept all the good things that they will have with you but they just need to work on themselves a little bit and um surpass these anxieties and and try and uh, trust people again i think so that was reading for group two thank you for watching please leave a comment um, about if it re resonated with you okay group three why are they not contacting you? Okay. Okay. Okay, why are they not contacting you, group three? Okay, I think that um, they're not contacting you because they're worrying about something that this relationship might lead to or they're worrying about something that's going on in their life right now. They're really burdened about this, um, whatever consequences there could be of their relationship. Um, they do feel that there is new beginnings with you and that life is always changing and good things can come to them i think they have hope and they have the awareness that um there are good things and new beginnings with you if they choose to pursue and just fully accept um the burdens um they do see a lot of potential and new opportunities for you they really do see that um but they're kind of struggling to let go of these burdens and all these worries happening that these, these worries are keeping them up at night they're really heavy on their mind and they don't know what to do about them they're just carrying them with them and they're just constantly thinking about them they feel like going into the relation this relationship there's things that they can't see there's things that might happen that um they want to prevent and they don't know what would happen 
so they're trying to avoid these um whatever might happen by just like worrying or thinking about everything but they really do see that they, you have a lot of potential in this relationship they do feel a lot they want to work towards having a better more fulfilling relationship with you they want to work towards you um and them being able to be together be happy with other people with you know just be happy in general um yeah they want to share the happiness that they feel with this of this relationship with their friends and family but they're worrying about something a lot um but i think they do have the awareness and the understanding that life can change things can change good things can come new opportunities can come but um they're just deeply worrying about something and they're deeply carrying this burden but um they think that there's things that might happen that they can't see yet and they can't understand yet and they're not foreseeing enough right now um so yeah uh i think that eventually they'll be able to reach out and pursue these new beginnings because they do feel a lot but they're just really worried and overthinking a lot so that's why um whoever you're thinking about hasn't contacted you please leave a comment if any of it resonated thank you